Good evening, LA Filnes. Uh, it's day eight, Sunday, uh, May 8, 2022. Welcome to our half million mobilization prayer journal. And uh, this our, uh, we're doing the praying our way to Pentecost. And uh, today's scripture insights were written by Jim Bond. Uh, District Superintendent, Kansas. In Luke chapter 10, verse 2, it says, He told them, The harvest is plentiful, but the workers are few. Ask the Lord of the harvest, therefore to send out workers into his harvest field. Scripture insights. Farmers understand this metaphor all too well. I once made my living as a potato farmer in the San Luis Valley of Colorado. We invested a lot of energy and work to get every potato into the bean before winter. We knew what to do. Harvest was about effort. We are naturally drawn to the words work and harvest in this text, but we must not get ahead of ourselves. We think of all we need to do to make Christ-like disciples. Perhaps the most important word here is ask. This is the only prayer request Jesus recorded in scripture to my knowledge. Our work begins and ends with asking and obediently listening in prayer. The work of harvesting is our Lord's work. We need to connect daily in prayer to follow his lead. My three-year-old granddaughter recently jumped into my lap when my phone alarm set for 10.02. Luke chapter 10, verse 2. She said, time to, time to pray, Papa. Will you join us as we pray for the harvest? Let us pray. Lord, today we ask you to send workers into the harvest for it is white. Lord, send pastors, church planters, missionaries, and great leaders into the harvest. And most importantly, Lord, send me into the harvest today. Help me to be mindful of someone who might need a witness today in both word and deed. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Prayer journal reflections. Uh, what is the Holy Spirit saying to you today about the Lord's protection, direction, and revelation for your life and the life of La Filness Church? Please comment down below, write your journal, make your journal, make your own journal, it's okay. Whatever, it's, uh, whatever is comfortable for you. I'll see you tomorrow. God bless you, Barangay Lafilnaz, and bye-bye. Uh, see ya.